What's up everybody? Spare with a gun here from Sleepless Nights with another episode on Space Engineers working on the um whatchamacallit? The multi-purpose ship that has no name at the moment. Um so one of the things I was thinking about is the connectors really didn't give me a whole lot more room than I was thinking they would. So what we could do just for security, I guess, is a good word, is put some merge blocks down. Not not so much for, like, well, actually, that won't do much, will it? Well, yeah, well, because the blocks should come down. Oh. They'll come down, and then... Hmm. In theory... Nope, that won't work. Because if we put another... Let's grab another ejector, connector, whatever. Is it connector? Yeah. So if we were to put another one, they're two blocks tall. So if we were to put this... These are smaller. Hmm. Now that's interesting. I didn't... I didn't think that through. This I still kind of like this because I'm getting kind of sold on the whole helipad or uh, orca type class fighter look. Um, but we would need to build off of this part though. See, so we'd have to do like this if we were gonna do anything. It would have to be like that, I think. Which, that's not bad. It almost kind of looks like rotors. Or, or fins or something. That's pretty cool. We'll go with that. Uh, do, 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 do. Now the only question is, what do you do with it? Because what we can do is run these here for some other purpose. Well, I don't know. I'm, I'm also trying to think of how big do we really want this ship to be. I'd actually like it to be as small as we can make it. Um, the other thing that I could put here... Um, somebody in the comments mentioned putting an extra reactor that wasn't tied in to the ship itself. Essentially because the conveyor system requires power to work. Um, I wonder if we could do something like this. Would that work? If we carried this back with us... It's different. This would have to go, though. You have to do it like that. Ooh, and then we could do like this. I like that. That looks kind of cool. Because we already connected the... Yeah, we already connected the connectors, so that's fine. Alright, I like that look. Let's go with that. I don't know what really look we're calling this yet, but it looks cool. Now, the other thing is to save on resources. I'm actually going to get rid of these. Okay. And you know what? The, the rate I'm going, this ship actually could have an interior, I think. Yeah, it actually could. You could fit through here. So we may want to remove the gyros at some point. And put in... um actually put them somewhere else and let there be a door. With that in mind, I am going to keep them in my hot bar for now. Uh... Is there... Is that an opening down there? 
Yes, it is. Okay. Okay, so... We'd only need to remove... Two. Three? Let's say two. To, to be able to get in from there. Ah, it doesn't matter. Even if we have an internal room. Alright, so we have chess. We have connectors to collect the chess. Let's run... Let's run a line here. And one here. Put a conveyor there. And the same over here. Then, what we'll do... Let's run a line like this. Conveyor. Line like this. Conveyor. So, all that's connected. Now, actually, hold on. We don't need to do all that. That's a lot of wasted resources. Because... Whoop! What did I break? Oh, I broke the conveyor belt. That's good. Because if these are connected, you can get to these. And if these are connected... Yeah, so we don't need that. So what I'm going to do now... Is... Let's make... We need an ejector. And we still didn't do the reactor thing. Okay. And we also need our thrusters. So let's work on that before we get too carried away. So that we have an idea of what we need. Can you do... Yeah, I guess you can do large. I want to try... I don't, I don't know mathematically what the equivalent to... Um... Yeah, thinking and talking. We all know how well I do that. I don't know what the equivalent to large thrusters to small ones is in terms of thrust, but I'd actually like to find out. Um, hmm. Actually, I don't like that there. Well the worst thing in the world. And we could continue... Okay, we'll leave it for now. Let's see how this ends up. Oh, wait, no, I don't like that. Come on. There's no block here, I guess. Is that what's the problem? It doesn't have anything to latch on to. Um... Yeah, I don't... That won't work. Because it's going to cut into the module there. If we did that... This would make it stick out, wouldn't it? On the bottom. Oh, unless we did this. That could work. So we have one... Oh, hold on. No. No, 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 no. I want to try and keep this even. So let's put it there. Maybe. I'm s uh, not really sold on that, actually. Let's do it this way. Um, let's say we've got... Oops, say this is the top, right? This is our top bar. 
Let's put it there. Right, forward and backwards is what we need now. Um, we'll just put it down here for now. I'm trying to see if this is enough thrust, is really what I'm going for. So the gyros... Whoa, that's plenty for gyroscopes. And yeah... So for the mass, this is good. This is good. Okay. But the only ones I'm really happy with are the sides. Those can stay. The rest I don't really like. Well, actually, what we could do is just put the ejector here. That would work. And then I want to put... Let's go ahead and put our backup reactor right there as well. Where did the reactors go? There they are. So we'll put our backup reactor right there. Where could I put the forward-facing, like, reverse engine that's not going to destroy something? We could cut into this. But it's too... Maybe not. Well, nuts. I think I have thruster damage on, so let's see something real quick. Uh, we're going to make a copy of this just in case we blow it up. turned off. <laughs> you do that? I didn't tell you to do that. Okay, so we have the issue here of the reverse thruster. That if we if we do something with it, it has to be unflush with the bottom. I don't like that. We could put it on this level. Oh. Why wouldn't it let me do that before? But then, of course, the only thing I'm afraid of is it getting away in the way of the arm. What if we made... Oops. Put the back one like this. this here. This is my problem with thrusters. They're, they're never in a good place. They always end up in the way, somehow. They just never work. Hmm. Let's see. I, this is currently, like, my only good spot. I'm, the only thing I can think of is also just as a test, we won't keep it this way. 
but how far out do you have to be before it doesn't destroy stuff? Like, I don't know if that will work or not. Okay, see, that just destroyed the other ship. <laughs> oh, that's good. It disconnected the whole thing. Lovely. Okay. So, the large ones apparently have to be very far. New plan. New plan. We're gonna turn off thruster damage. No. Uh -huh. Hmm. It's kind of it's kind of risky, but I wonder if we could put. Um. I wonder if we could put the inside here. Is that how I had it before? I think it is. Okay. Ooh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I got a bit I got a bit of an idea. Scary, right? So if we did something like that. And we did it like this. to side forward okay that works I'm okay with that I think <laughs> whoa and then we could do... There we go. Like that. Oh. I'll make it unflush. Come on. Up one. Just go up one. It did it before. Ah. Uh. Oh, wait. There we go. We just won't attach it to that. Aha. I'm sneaky. Power usage is too high, though. But it works really well. Actually, I might get rid of the gyro, a couple of gyros, just so it's not so wobbly. Let's get rid of those two and see what it does. Yeah, that's better. It's a lot more stable. Okay, so now we do have the design issue to work with, however. Oop, what did I just delete? I broke something. Oh, it was one of these. Not entirely sure how that we'll actually need those, to be honest. That's headed. And we can do we 
Oops, I don't know how that's going to look yet, but this part we do. That works. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Temporarily, I don't know if we'll actually do this or not, but... Yeah. Okay. Now, let's, let's work on the bottom a little bit. First of all, let's... What is this here? Cargo crate. Okay, let's... Remove you. Remove... You. Put a conveyor. No, wrong button. And we'll add an, an extra... Power unit here. That may help with the power. Yeah, there. Wait. Oh, it's if you're turning. If you just thrust, it's fine. Sort of. I don't know. Whatever. At the moment, I'm not overly worried about it, because it doesn't seem to do a whole lot when the power's not running. Okay. What we could do... I don't know how this would look. But we could do something like this. Oh, copy and paste. Er, how I've missed you. Um, let's see, we could get rid of that. Do something like that. I see. We had it like this. That works, I think. Maybe. Oh, hold on. This is wrong. breaking stuff. Hold on. Why does it keep grabbing the wrong thing? There we go. That looks pretty cool. I like that. Not cool. <sighs> okay. What we could do here... the other way, don't we? Alright. Well, that's a good enough start. We can tweak the design as we go. Um, in the meantime, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. Let me know what you think and all that good stuff, and I will see you all next time. Peace!